A CL financial seminar was held on Sunday at the Centenary Hall of St. Mary's College in Port of Spain. There were many talking points in the meeting and Peter Christopher gives us more in this report. As he opened the seminar, attorney Ramesh Lawrence Mirage sought to clear up the finer points about the ongoing court matters between the government and the Clico shareholders. Mr. Maharaj explained the part of his counter-argument to the state's intention to petition to unwind Clico. And you have to have audited financial statements in order to get a winding up of the company, then I do not know on what basis they can get that. So my hope is that the court would recognize that the petition is deficient because it does not have that evidence before it. And to, to get a company wound up, you have to be able to establish that it's insolvent. He also explained that those who looked into Clico's assets had compiled reports which suggested that liquidation could potentially be a disaster. But this part of the discussion was taken up with a bit more fluency through Afro Raymond, who also questions the government's decision to go for liquidation, or rather the conversion of Clico's assets into cash, as he believes that negotiation could be a better route. I have questioned publicly whether, in light of its failure, to apply the fit and proper rules, whether the central bank as an institution is itself fit and proper to hold those powers. So I, I could agree with you to that extent. Mr. Raymond also raised questions about the generally unknown state of CL Financial's accounts. Mr. Raymond, too, has a pending matter against the state concerning the release of information on those accounts, and his concern was shared by shareholder Brian Moore. I would have There was a brief disagreement which had to be quelled by the chairman of the meeting as one man did present what he claimed to be 2016 accounts for various Clico companies. Mr. Raymond admitted to seeing those documents but still believed that liquidation was not the process required. The CL financial matter will return before the courts on Tuesday as the government's liquidation appeal will be heard. Peter Christopher, C News.